Hey guys, thanks for joining us today. Michael here, Weeby Autos. Today we have a beautiful bike. It's a 2005 Texas Chopper, but it's been torn down and built up from the ground up. Every piece of this bike is custom and absolutely phenomenal. We've got Tobin here, he's going to tell us a little bit about it. How are we doing, Tobin? How you doing? Man, what a beautiful bike, bro. Thank you very Holy much. Holy cow. Thank you. Tell yeah. us a little about it. Well, um, it's a 2005 Texas Chopper. I wanted to find a soft tail bike that uh, rode good, that had a good foundation that I could build from that point on. Okay. Uh, I always loved the tank on a Texas Chopper. It was one of my favorite parts. And uh, one of the least favorite parts of these choppers was the skinny front ends that they put on them. And, yeah, you got a nice beefy front end yeah, on there. God. Yeah, American suspension uh, built that for me. Okay. Uh, it was something I felt would uh, encapsulate the back tire as well. I and mean, you have a huge back tire and, a, and, a, and an elongated tank and a skinny front end. So it's a 45 millimeter inverted front end. What size is that back tire? Uh, it's a 280. Wow. The, uh, the front end was powder coated and then accented with chrome cuffs. All the brake lines are run inside the tubes, so oh. there's no brake lines. It's dual rotors. Dual calipers, but no brake lines. Man, that's beautiful. The brake lines come inside the tubes and come out the top of the trees. Such a clean look. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. A very that, uh, clean motorcycle. Jeez, bro, the powder coating almost looks like paint. Yeah, the powder coating we did, we powder coated it and then wet sanded and polished it to uh, 3,000. So and that's it why looks, it looks like paint. It looks like, uh, like paint. So cool. Man, that's some rake on there, bro. Diamond cut, painted heads. Just did the motor over, didn't have to, just wanted, figured if I broke it down, I might as well do the whole thing over. Yeah. So Superbikes, East Coast Superbikes here, did a full five angle valve job, quartered polished. I uh, powder coated and diamond cut the heads. I freshened the whole motor up. Uh, I put in a Dana S uh, ignition system. Mm -hmm. I took all the computers out of these, out of this motorcycle. Wow, what size is it? Uh, it's a, it's a uh, 117 S and S, and it's put 100, putting 126 horsepower to the rear tire on the dyno. <laughs> wow! <laughs> so it's a little handful, huh? It's uh, the bike goes real well. I love the gauges too. Beautiful. Uh, the gauges are actually one of the things that I kept from uh, Texas Chopper Iron Horse because it's it, it, it was nice. It, it, it went with the bike. It was one of the things that I kept on the bike. Pretty cool. Sissy Bar is another one that I kept. That's just uh, running through because of the ref refresh rate. It doesn't do that. It's showing zero right now and neutral. And so beautiful. Let's fire it up. Yeah, we will. spot that's comfortable for you. So it's not it's a nice comfortable ride, so yeah, tail. it gives you uh, it gives you a really great ride and then when you want that real tough, you know, rigid look you can drop the bike down. Wow. So if you go to the other side I'll, I'll drop it down so they can see how it looks. Got a BDL three and a half inch open primary. Bike has a Legend Air Ride system in it. Okay. 
All the forward controls, what are those? Forward controls, uh, to be honest with you, I don't even know. They're pretty I don't cool, remember. Bro. I don't remember. I wanted to go with a pointed theme on everything. Yeah. Everything seems to come to a point. Yeah. Uh, one of the one of the only things I was gonna do uh, that I didn't do yet was to, to, to actually have the sissy bar come to a point. Oh, I was yeah. gonna do that and rechrome it. Uh, that and looks it's, great you know, though, bro. Whoever wants the bike, if they wanted to do that, I would do that for them. Well guys, thanks for joining us today. Again, my name is Mike from Weeby Autos. Uh, you can call us directly at 631-339-0399. You can also check out more pictures, information, and details on our website. It's WeebyAutos.com. Thanks a lot and have a great day.